All right. First, I'm going to demonstrate uh, the kinesthesia of the hand and the wrist. <clears throat> and then I'll do sharp, dull uh, sensation testing for the superficial peroneal nerve on the lower extremity. Uh, okay, that's good. I can show that. Okay, so palm up. So first I'm going to start down at the distal end of the finger. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to let your hand relax. I'm going to move your finger up like this, and that's up, and that's down, okay? okay. So, um, so what is this? Up. And what is this? Down. Okay, so close your eyes, and I want you to tell me whenever it's up and when it's down. Up. Okay, go and open up your eyes. We're gonna move a little bit further down towards your next joint here. And same thing, this is up and that's down. So what is that? Up. And what is this? Down. Okay, go ahead and close your eyes. Up, up, down, 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 up. Okay, now I'll move a little bit more proximal. We're gonna go to the finger here, so the whole finger. This is up, same thing, this is down. Okay. okay. Close your eyes. Up, down, down, up, up. Okay. Now we're going to go ahead and move in to the thumb. So this is down and this is up. Okay. What is that? Down. And what is this? Up. Okay. Close your eyes. Down, down, down. Up, up, down. Okay. Now we're moving on to the wrist. So for your wrist here, that's up and that's down. Okay. okay. Close your eyes. Up, up, down, down, up, down, down. Okay. Now using a paper clip, the pointed end out is going to be the sharp sensation and the rounded end is going to be the dull sensation. So I'm just going to show you here first with your eyes open. So this is the sharp sensation, okay? You okay. feel that? Mm -hmm. And this is the dull sensation. Okay. Okay. So well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to press it on certain points on your leg and I want you to tell me if you feel that it's sharp or if you feel that it's dull. Okay. okay. Go ahead and close your eyes. Sharp. Sharp. In the first test, testing the kinesthesia of the wrist and hand, uh, we were using we were testing the dorsal column medial lemniscus tract, and uh, this is using the sensory input that travels into the dorsal root ganglion first, and then um, from the dorsal root ganglion uh, to the fasciculus cuneatus in the dorsal column of the spinal cord, and then travels up and it synapses in the lower medulla and uh, decusates. Uh, or into the nucleus cuneatus before it decusates and then decusates uh, crossing over um, as the internal arcuate fibers and ascends as the medial lemniscus that's why it's the dorsal column medial lemniscus tract and then synapses at the VPL of the thalamus then uh, travels to the primary somatosensory cortex um, and then finally off to its a spot in the homunculus, which in this would be a superior lateral uh, portion of the homunculus. In the second, the sharp dull test, we are testing pain, so that's the spinal thalamic tract. And in this case, the pain sensation also travels through the dorsal root ganglion. Um, then it synapses on the ipsilateral uh, dorsal horn um, on lamina. And then it decusates immediately across uh, across there um, and uh, to the anterior lateral system. Uh, then this travels up the spinal cord and the brain stem uh, to the thalamus. 
and then synapses to the VPL in the thalamus and uh, finally travels to its uh, to the primary somatosensory cortex.